turned 31 and decided I needed to reboot my life. So I'm starting with my body and then moving on to trying to find a new job and a new place to live. Juicers. Good morning. First day juicing here. I uh, woke up a little bit early. So I think I'm pretty excited. So this is prepped some vegetables, some carrots, some celery, apple, bowl of spinach. I'm not sure if this is enough yet, but I'm gonna start here. So I'm gonna juice this up. So that made me a little over 24 ounces of super green juice. But I think I wanna get up to 32 ounces since this is gonna be my uh, breakfast and lunch. So do a little more celery, I believe. I'm at 32 ounces now, so I guess I learned instead of doing half a celery heart, do the whole thing. And so 16 of this is for my breakfast. Four hours later, the next half, I'm off to work, and I'll be back. I guess I should do a cheers to day one and let you see, see what it tastes like. That's good. Very green. Not too sweet, but not bitter or anything. Here we go again. Just got done. Got off from work. It's around 6.45, 6.30. I'm making my second batch of juice for the day. And this is what I've got lined up. So I add a little bell pepper, a little more of the lime. Pretty much the same setup though. So. I'm gonna process this and we'll see how much juice I get. Jessica decided that the pulp is edible, and it does look really... It's still a vegetable. Yeah. Just because it doesn't have juice doesn't mean we can't add some juice to it. It's yeah. true. Re <laughs> rehydrate it. Yeah, add it's some like water. teriyaki sauce and some uh, curry. Get them to take all the water. So she's just putting the water back into the vegetables, apparently. We'll check back in on this in a second. If you like made soup, you can put it in your soup. It's like thicken up your soup. Yeah. Pasta. You could cool it off and put it in the fridge and eat it like a salsa. You could probably make a pasta out of it. Like mm -hmm. press it through this and make noodles. Or use it as a sauce. Well, are you going to eat all that? <laughs> no. I'm way too for that. Yeah, well, she's cooking. This is how much juice I got today out of that batch. It's a very... It only gets the foam because I pour it into here, but it's a very kind of brownish, greenish color. And I'm going to pour some up. A new taste tester for my second batch. It's not bad. Not bad, huh? Mm -mm. The lime, I think, really helps helps cut the the veginess of it. It's almost like tomato juice without the tomatoes. Yeah, and there's no tomatoes in there. Mm. It's all the bell pep pepper, probably. I haven't tried it yet. I like it. So ultimately, she took a few bites, and she just threw it away. So <laughs> I didn't get to try it. I don't know what it tastes like. But she apologized for wasting my compost. 
even though I wasn't gonna compost it, it was gonna end up here anyhow. Birdie. Those are good, huh? Yeah, those are really good. Uh, there might be some more. A thumbs up is appreciated. Please join me on my journey, especially if you're on a similar journey. I would love the company. You can join me on Facebook and Twitter.